Hello everyone, today I'm going to provide you guys a clear guide on how to disable sanity checks for Borderlands 2 because I've noticed maybe some people uh, probably don't know how to do this properly so uh, I'm here to give a guide for Epic Games Store and also uh, Steam uh, for Borderlands 2. If you don't know what sanity checks is, it's basically it's a uh, feature where it pretty much just like double checks your weapons to see if there's any broken parts on it and if it detects a broken part uh, it'll like automatically delete it for you. So I'm gonna teach you how to disable that and allow guns such as this to exist. This is basically a Vladov sniper mixed with a bada boom barrel. Ignore why there's no skin. I set the material to nothing. And uh, yeah, as you can see here, it's pretty much just a Vladov sniper with the bada boom barrel, as I just said. So yeah, I'm gonna teach you guys how to disable sanity checks to allow the guns like this to exist in your game. So let's get right into it. Right off the bat, you will need to uh, close your game entirely, so do that real quick. Now once you made sure that everything is actually closed off, you're gonna wanna head to this website over here in Nexus Mods. You're gonna wanna download the Borderlands Hex Multi-Tool. I'll provide a link in the description if you guys wanna download it for yourself. Just click on download over here, and once you do, you're gonna receive this zip file over here. Just click on it, and then click on the folder that's inside. And then click on the other zip file inside. You should see this, uh, these assortment of files, and then you're going to want to click on the application over here. And then there you go. This is the Borderlands Hex multi-tool. And then uh, if you notice that your games over here are like grayed out, that basically means that there's no file path set yet. So we're going to get a solution for that. Depending on which game you're playing, you're going to want to select a path for that. So for me, it's Borderlands 2, so I'm going to click that one. And then, as you can see, the .exe file is right here. Now, a common issue I kind of notice around here is that some people don't actually know where their Epic Games Borderlands 2.exe file is, and I'm going to explain it for both Steam and Epic Games. So, for Steam, you want to go to uh, Program Files, and then after that, Steam, Steam Apps, Borderlands 2, Binaries, Win32, and then you'll find your .exe file there. Now, for uh, Epic Games, you're going to want to head to your local disk, usually it's a C one, and then you're going to hit Crowbang Files here. And then after that, Epic Games, Borderlands 2, Binaries, Win32. And then there you go. Your .exe file is right here. So you're going to click on that one. And then as you can see, it is no longer grayed out. So you want to click on this. And now a loading screen will appear, but this will just take a second. All right, there we go. Now as soon as it's done, uh, as you can see, you can like interact with anything here now. And then, uh, yeah, so... To disable sanity checks, you want to head to miscellaneous over here, and then you'll see an option called disable sanity checks. You want to click on that, and then just tick weapons and items to a check, and then uh, you're going to click apply over here, and then there you go. You have your Borderlands 2 sanity checks disabled, and now you can allow any type of, I guess, broken weapon into your game. So uh, yeah, very, very easy to do. Uh, uh, literally anyone can do it. Uh, so uh, yeah. I don't know what else to tell you guys, but uh, that's pretty much it for this video. It's very easy to do. Uh, I would like it if you guys subscribed. It really helps out a ton, and it's free anyway, so yeah, it doesn't cost you anything to do that. So if you found this helpful, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching the video, and enjoy your day.